the Julie's World vlog. <laughs> Hello! So I'm wearing a shirt that I made, which makes me so happy. Um, you guys, this house is going to be the death of me. Uh, no, I mean, I'm having fun, but it's also insane. It's also like financially hysterical. It's also, 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 I mean, it's going to be amazing and fantastic when it's done. But every day I feel like there are insane decisions to make and I just, I feel overwhelmed with all of it. It's like having a second job, like a real full-time constant job that drives you insane. So, uh, anyway, there's a big long peek into the house this week. So I think you'll enjoy that. We go on a road trip to New Hampshire looking for cabinets is our second or third um, cabinet place that we've been looking at. So we are on the hunt. I'm doing a little DIYing. There's art uh, baking. Overall, I would say it's a very good week. I'm working on some new online classes that I'm super excited about that I hope to debut in April. And I'm glad that you're here. And just so you know, your comments and likes and all that stuff always makes me feel so happy and so good. So thanks for watching. getting ready to go to my mom's house to do some baking. She's going to teach me to make her um, chocolate chocolate chip cake, which was always the uh, cake that my brother requested for his birthday. So I'm excited. This is my Great British Baking Show moment. I have never turned cakes out, so I've seen them do it on TV, and I'm hoping, oh God, I'm hoping that I am also going to be able to do it. Okay, here we go. El momento de truth. What? Oh, my hot mitt is stuck under, this is a lot less glamorous. Whoop. <laughs> Yay! My fabulous dinner party life, everybody gets their own little bunt cake. That was my plan or my thought. And, and, and then one? the hostess gets this one. <laughs> Sadly, the second cake, part of it stayed in the pan. So I'm going to taste test it because I'm a scientist and I care about quality. Pretty good, but I want to do a second test to be sure. Finding some final clues for your scavenger hunt. Oh, yeah. So, Mom and I are having a girls' night out. We are here at the museum running around doing whatever. And then we are going to an opening at this art gallery that a friend of ours owns. So, we're doing a art immersion of all kinds. This is my car. My mother said I couldn't make it into this spot. It was very close, but I'm in. I was 
wrong. <laughs> online class all about faces so I have like a million little pieces of paper with odd sketches so I had planned to spend the whole day in my pajamas in the house and then I got this great idea for painting my own tiles for the fireplace rounds since tiles are so expensive um, so I went to Home Depot to look for some supplies I am still in my pajamas under this coat um, and now I'm gonna swing by the house and see how things are going there Steve is out of town so I get to do whatever I want so um, they've built a box around the Newell on the first floor and there's like a little built-in bench. They've boarded up the windows so they don't get hurt. The stairs you can see are completely down. I mean the stairs are, parts are still there but like the rail. This is the new stairs to the basement that took us a while to build. Um, this is my first time seeing the house where there's usually a second door right here. Um, and they've also of course demoed everything in the walls here it's it's really insane um eventually there's actually going to be a wall here and that door is going away and you'll come into the living room where there's going to be a fireplace right there um and then let's see if i can climb over this wood uh and this is the dining room and you can see the fireplace in here Pretty cool. And uh, then that's going to be the kitchen. So originally there was a wall there and we decided not to close it up. This is going to have a bathroom and like be a little mud room and stuff. And there'll be a new back door. So you can enter from the back of the house there. So it's going to be cool. So when we took down the walls, we found that they had covered up a window and that that window, which we thought was original with the curve, has clearly been added in at some point, which was kind of house sleuthing. So I'm prototyping my painted tiles. This is layer one. Well, I mean, it's multiple layers to make layer one, but I wanted to have them have a hand painted look. So I used multiple colors, multiple passes, etc. And then I can't decide whether I probably would, will glaze them, but I have to figure out what to use for the glaze. And I have to figure out if this paint will even stick to these tiles. I'll see you next week.